everybody, Gamer Penny here, bringing you another episode of our Spirit Fair Let's Play, and it is time to say goodbye. But I think her name is Alice. <laughs> um, she said that she was ready to go. The dragon was getting stronger and stronger, so we're gonna go down here to the Ever Door. Um, to do that, let's find a bus stop real quick. Uh, probably this one is the closest one. Let's, um, go up here, do some, get some carrots, we'll plant some more carrots, water. Okay, what did we need for that windmill? Marble and an oak plank. Okay, we can make a bunch of oak planks actually. I don't know quite yet where we get marble. Uh, where am I going? No. Here. Uh, this one. Okay. Oak. Tool, you messed me up now. Wow, we're doing terrible. There. Oh, that was almost a perfect one. There we go. What do you do with the sawdust again? Put it in the oven or something? There's something you can do with it. Uh oh, we froze for a second. Oh, because we're going through the ice again. Okay, that should give us enough planks for that when we decide to do the windmill. Hey, my dude. I would like to travel to the other door. Alright, this is gonna be sad. We're gonna. Hey. I'm gonna feed you and shear you real quick. <laughs> okay. Now, up here. How's our other sheep doing? Fabulous garden. Thank you. Feed him. I got planks. You do. Ooh. Planks, get your planks. Made some planks for you, Stella. Enjoy. Thank you for the oak plank. Oh. oh, goodness. Stella! Are you ready to go? Thank you. Can we hug one more time, though? Wait. No? Are you super happy? She is super happy. Okay. Good. I want them to go when they're at their happiest. Oh, they're standing here to say goodbye. I 
really thought I could keep up with it this time. The dragon. I was certain it was calming down. I could feel it purring. The warmth of it in my chest. Does the dragon, like, regret or depression or something? I guess I just did it all over again. Just like my father. The dragon is a beast. Indomitable, if I recall my own words correctly. Whether you chose to care for it or beat it down. Oh, what would Rose think of me? Would she be proud? Would she be ashamed? I can't help but wonder what she would have done in my stead. But I know. I know what she would have told me. She would have looked me straight in the eye. Her gaze would have pierced through the veil of my appearance. She wouldn't have said a word. She knew from the beginning. She knew the dragon would take me away. She knew I would have tried to love it and not hate it. She would have judged me for my failure. I couldn't love it, Stella. I just couldn't. As much as I hate it, it is a part of me now. It will be forever. If I want to leave gracefully, I must accept it for what it is now. What is it, though? I was looking forward to so many more lessons with you. You have been such a gifted student, Stella. I'm so proud of you. So proud of your heart. So proud of your blossoming soul. I'm sorry to leave you. You'll have to learn by yourself. I have no doubt that you'll pull through. The only lesson I have left is to show you what we're made of. Of ephemer ephemeral starlight. We're but a few particles of thought on this vast stream of consciousness. This is the last thing I can teach you, Stella. That all things change. That all things end. Aww. That's really sad. <laughs> the dragon, like, um... So proud of you, Stella. I know Rose would be, too. Thank you for everything. Hmm. Big lawn hug. get memories of her and Rose now. She gets her star up in the sky. Her constellation. Aww. The snick. <laughs> oh, pressy. I <laughs> did it again. But we do have a spirit blossom from our house now, though. Right here. Spirit flower. Ugh. This game gets me in the feels sometimes. Is the dra was the dragon- I guess it could be anything like regret. Depression, consciousness, like... It's just a part of you that doesn't change. You can either embrace it or get rid of it. Alright. Let us... Take a look here. We are here. I can't get through the rocks, so I can't go here. Is there any other, like, new place we haven't gone to yet? Can't get through that. What is this, tuna? Oh, we could try to go out that way. Okay, let's go to the bus stop. 
try the nebula fiber again. Weren't there some things that we needed spirit flowers for? I don't think any of those. So this is how many people, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nebula fabric. Hey, my dude. <laughs> I don't need the spirit flower. Hold on, let me take a look at. Oh, spirit flower, one of two. So we need the rock destroyer for that. Okay. We really need to get this. We can do this as well. The blueprint tra table. Okay. We got mail. I will check that out in a moment. We are gonna go up to try to fish some tuna. Oh, I need to go to the bus stop first. We'll fish some tuna. We'll see if we can do anything with those pill bugs. What is this? Oh, Feederama. Open. Corn flour and a lobster. Lobster roll. You wouldn't happen to have any chicken. <laughs> so I can make fried chicken for my uncle, huh? Spirit flour. Corn flour. What do we need for the windmill again? Marble now is what we need. Hmm. Okay, let's try this first. Hey. Marble. Where do you think we would get marble? I feel like there's no new places for us to go is the problem. We should be fishing. Vase. Oh, okay. Hello, 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 hello. Oh. oh, you're tired, aren't you? Wait, there's the bug. Of course, so many children are bound to leave you exhausted. Maybe we could play with them a bit, let you rest. What do you think, Stella? Wonderful. Oh, we'll have so much fun. I used to play this game with my grandchildren all the time. Just catch them and bring them back to their mommy. Oh my god. <gasps> In here, you guys. I do it one at a time. All right, that's how we got our fiber. Okay, well, that's how you do that one. Is this a different seashell down there? Alright, they can't travel any fat any farther. Because it is nighttime. I see. Okay. Uh no, I don't want to go to bed yet because while we can't move, we should try to make some nebula um fabric here. Oh my god. Ok, 
Okay, we did pretty darn good on that. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's try this now. Okay. Oh, we got good fabric out of that. All right, so now we can build the windmill, I think. No. We can... What were we go going after? Oh, this. The orchard. Uh, build. <laughs> we need a bigger boat before we do anything else. Yeah, right there. Okay, we've got the orchard. We need marble for the windmill. Um, we're all good there. We could build this, but I, I don't. Unless you want to go like real quick up the middle, but I think maybe that will be good when we're uh, we have the bigger boat. Let's look at improving. So, uh, she's still here. Hers is completely improved, and our uncle is still here. Oh, he'll. If we make linen fabric, it's gonna be good. Okay, let's go make linen fabric. Hopefully I have linen fabric. Luckily we have some lin linen in the garden if we absolutely need it. Okay. Oh crap. And go so slower. linen fabric now. We can upgrade uncle's house. This. We have enough for it, so spice up your life. So now he's got this, this. Now he just needs this. Ash plank bottled ectoplasm. Okay, now we go to sleep. Get morning ready. Uh, and then we'll decide what we want to do in the morning. Maybe we'll get some new quests in the morning. We'll see. Man, I love this game. This is so much fun. <laughs> it just sometimes you play a game and it hits you like, oh, I'm having so much fun playing this game. We'll definitely check out the orchard today when, um, what's her name gets up. Wakey wakey! Eggs and bakey! Let's go water these guys first. The lettuce? No, stop. She's going up to the orchard, huh? Let's get the carrot planted. Water that. And then once they're fully grown, we'll probably just let them let them go now because we're not doing too much cooking. Yay, we got the orchard. Oh, oh, Stella, you've built an orchard and it looks almost exactly like the one my husband built. Have you seen all these fine details? Yes, he was quite the woodworker, at least until his hands gave up on him. We planted our first apple tree along with the birth of our first daughter. You should plant a tree for yourself. Of course, it'll take some time before it can bear fruit. But once grown, it makes you feel so proud. Accompanies you your whole life. Oh, listen to me rambling again. I'll get out of your things now. Alright, let's plant the... What do we have? Apples and oranges. Grow a tree in the orchard. We've got an apple tree. Water. Okay. And we'll do a cherry tree. Look that. Perfect. There's only two spots in the orchard, huh? Okay, hey, how do you like your upgrade a tool? Ooh. I'm not feeling so hot right now. Got a lot on my mind. Keep thinking about my friend Zazie. Did you ever meet her? We used to organize rallies when we were younger. This picture of her and me is the only picture I have in my wallet. 
Had it for over 40 years. Damn. Your Aunt Viv would murder me if she knew I didn't at least have one picture of our kids. And she adored Zaz. Everyone did. Maybe we should hang it in my house. I won't get rid of the folds, but at least I won't get water all over it. Aww. Um, I'm gonna give you a fisherman's pie. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep them coming. And a hug. Because you said you're not feeling good. Okay. Those are sheep. He's good. No, wait, is she hungry over here? Little one. Yes. My stomach is turning. Do you have anything to eat? Yes, I was just coming to give you something. Um, do you like dessert? Oh my! <laughs> you must know I really love dessert of all kinds. Thanks a lot, Stella. You do? Is that her favorite? Oh no, she just likes old-fashioned food and dessert. And how about a hug? That's very nice, thank you. Okay, is she doing good? Yes, she's very good. Okay. Travel to Susan's museum at 150, negative 150, 150. Maybe we can do that. I know, you want chicken wings. Okay. Where is negative 150? Wait, negative 150 up here. Negative 150. Like right here. Okay, we're gonna go into the abyss, the great unknown. Um, let's cook then if we are, you know what we should do? What do we have in our inventory? Anything to sell? A couple things. That won't give us 8,000 though. Can we sell this stuff? Oh, we can sell our crops. Okay. So coffee bean seed is 37, and a coffee bean is 90. All right, so either way, we'd make a profit. Can I make a lobster in the, whoops. I don't wanna make a stew though, I want. Let's see what that does. Hopefully we didn't ruin that. Don't forget, you want a chicken wing, I know. This is a new kind of shell down here. Hold on, I'm gonna jump into the freezing water. Wait for me, wait for me, wait for me, wait for me, wait for me! <laughs> yeah, give me the shell, man. An oyster, okay. Oh, hello, Fluffykins. First of all, you're hungry. We'll shear ya. Oh, crates, hold on. I gotta get out there and get them. Wait! Wait! Wait, crates! Cabbage seed, cotton seed, pear seed. Really? What is that? Oh, a limestone, a vibrant necklace. Okay. I know, don't forget. I think I need a bucket of fried chicken right now. Yes. I don't have a chicken. Uh, what was I doing? So, if we can sell our crops, I should get a stockpile of crops to... Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, what the heck is that? It's a big old sheep dropping down. Uh, I mean, let's 
plant this cotton then. Um, more coffee. We can sell the coffee beans from it. Hey you. I share ya. Alright, what'd we make? Lobster or something? Hopefully not like a... We did make a stew, man. So- Wait, it said something. Southern something. Susan's museum discovered. Oh, perfect. Alright, what'd we make? Wait, no! Stop! Southern boil. Okay. Stop it. No, I want to go here. Go this. What is that dragon up there? Is that the one we already knew? Southern boil, huh? Regular exotic. Interesting. Can I make something with the oysters? Shellfish. Okay, let's do this first. And then we'll worry about cooking. Because this might unlock some new people for our ship, too. Oh my god. <laughs> hey. Oh great. Just fantastic. The spirit fair is here. Oh, this god's forsaken rock. In the middle of the ocean. She came all the way over here. She saw the cold, steep surface of the cliffside below with its broken ladder. She saw all that and thought, yes, how inviting. Surely I am welcomed here. <laughs> well, you found me. No use running from it anymore. Let me run the old tape for you. Ahem. Mm -hmm. Spirit fair, whose name I don't know, nor care to know, I am the Collector, otherwise known as Susan. The gods and all their materialistic arrogance have played a cruel trick on me. You see, I am the Collector, not by choice, but by duty. Mm -hmm. Through your ceaseless plunder of this world's very finite wonders, you will no doubt come to stockpile a collection of junk to rival the greatest garbage dumps of history. My duty is to reward this unconscious no unconscionable mm -hmm. behavior with, well, more junk. What irony is it not? My predecessors used to ask for the accumulated bundles as payment to do who knows what with. But the job description says nothing about that, and I certainly have no interest in your filth. So when the time comes, show me what monstrous assortments you managed to put together, grab your meaningless reward, and leave. Quickly. And pick up after yourself. Collections. Uh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, okay. Claim this reward. Mm -hmm. Broken shiny rocks. What a joy. Well, you've got a long day ahead of you. Listen, don't let me keep you, spirit, spirit fair. You have two jobs now. Finding gems and spirits. By the way, whoever came up with such a ridiculously sounding name as spirit fair? It sounds terrible and doesn't roll off the tongue like my name. Susan. Susan. Susan the Collector. Uh, everything uh, else? Uh, so we get a diamond and something else there. Oh, okay. Easter outfit. Uh, oh. I'm gonna cook food, man. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Oh, and in, in one more dish, we get an outfit. Uh, really? Uh, <laughs> now two more, we get the paintings. Oh wow, halfway there, finder of bright rocks. You must really love the way they look. You are amused by such mortal things. It figures. Well, I'm not keeping you. Go. Oh, okay, we're mostly done then. Claim this reward. Well, let's see what you've got now. Looks like some kind of... Why? Why in the name of everything that is holy and, ho and beautiful do you carry this horrible thing around? 
is not only offensive to my oh. eyes, it hurts the mm -hmm. very essence of my soul. Mm -hmm. But wait, I recognize this. Oh, oh no. Mm -hmm. I should have known from the very beginning. It's that man, isn't it, who sent you? That shallow, materialistic, superficial fraud of an intellectual. He sent you here, didn't he? What a crooked, treacherous weasel. He's mad about losing his precious little woodprint, isn't he? Well, now he's never going to see it again, I can guarantee it. Perhaps he can learn a thing or two about aestheticism. And as for this preposterous, silly collection your reward is, let's see. No, this can't be. No, the fates can't be so cruel. Well, all right, just take it. Take the bloody woodprint. Go back to the blabbering fool. Just, just take anything you want and get out of my sight. <laughs> okay. So I can't claim that one. Blackberry outfit, cool. We can claim this. How exciting. You've started collecting a new type of junk. This time it's fish. They smell bad and they're all terribly ugly, yet you can't help but try to catch them all, can you? Fortunately for me, you probably won't be able to complete this collection. They're slippery little bastards. <laughs> I got something out of that. Next reward, a diamond. Okay. We'll claim this reward. Oh, how wonderful. You've pillaged almost all of the precious gems around. How lucky this world is. Oh, great destroyer, show us your ways. Oh, great. Well, you're clearly not even listening. Take this and leave. I've got two old carpets. Okay. Alright, that's everything that we can claim from this now. Alright, bye. Interesting, so we gotta... I'm gonna work on completing those collections, you know. Um, give the woodprint uh, to the art collector at Furugawa. Can't do that yet. Okay. Furugawa. That unlock something else. Blum. Oh, good. <laughs> Lord C. Pier. Hey, I want to sell to you. If we cook one more dish, one more new dish, um, we can come back there and claim another reward. There is that. Oops. How are you doing, sheep? Yeah, I checked on you earlier. What are these? Cotton. Coffee. Uh-oh. Someone has a quest. A collector has a quest. Hey, Francis says, it's your lucky day. How lucky you must be. Got a new errand just for you, fresh off the presses. Have a look-see. Okay, but first I need to sell some stuff. This. These. Are we gonna get 8,000 from this? I mean, we got dang close. <laughs> Alright, don't sell seeds. We could sell... I mean... I mean the whole, still smells pretty bad. We haven't been able to cook with these, though. I'll put it on to 20. Too dark to navigate, I know. Get some carrots over there. We're down to 10. Alright, 8,000. What errands do you have? Oh! A couple more iron ingots and we can do the treasure map. Apple pie, corn dog, noodle soup. We can do that. I haven't got sockeye salmon. Well, we can do this. Give him that. Okay. We can get lettuce seeds, tea seeds, and a citrine. Might as well do this, just for the sake of it. 700 glims, and that one. Okay. Alright, we got a lot of money. Let's go to sleep for the night, and we will... Uh, go to that new place that popped up. Oh, I really want to... I need to water my trees. We'll do that on the way to the new place. And then we'll go back to Furugawa and turn in that woodprint to the art collector. Because I think he's a new... 
a new guy for our, uh, our ship. But the problem is, we need to upgrade the ship to get bigger. So let's go up here. Um, ding. Let's take a look at... Can't do that yet. Get a bigger boat. We can do this. That's what I was looking for. We need more iron ingots to get that one. Okay. We need to get more iron from somewhere. Go on an iron run. What are these? Water the trees. Okay. Nord Sea Pier. Oh, we need zip line. That's what that line is. I can tell already. We need the zip line to do more stuff here. There's an oyster down there. Hold on. Oops. Oh my god. I'm stuck. Okay. Let's go, kitty cat. Locked. Hmm. I've got a that face. Larry Salzburg nose face. And yours could be on a poster. On a billboard. You're not talking, but I can imagine your voice. And I hate it. But we can fix that in post. We'll get on one of the girls to dub everything. You'll be perfect. Mm -hmm. What? You're not an actress? You don't do vaudeville? You've never been with Zeigfeld? Nothing for those French shepherd dresses or whatever it's called. Mm -hmm. It's impossible. You would have been perfect. But if that's true, you're pure undiscovered talent. Mm -hmm. I must have you in my next picture. I must. I don't have a script nor a director, but that doesn't mm -hmm. matter. It'll be called something like Visions of Perfection. A thriller, mm -hmm. murder, suspense. Something to get the blood boiling. Something to make the town talk. Talking about my young new star. It'll be a box office smash. Can't you see it? Yes. I knew I could count on just walking the streets. You'll be a star in no time or my name isn't Larry Salzburg. Now we need to find you a co-star. My casting director is on her honeymoon with her new beau. Somewhere warm, it doesn't matter. What does matter is this picture I just thought about in the last five minutes. I do need a cast. Uh, I do need to cast this picture with stars. Star power. This town is drier than my shirts on a clothesline in the summer. Let's see. Joan is filming that daughter-mother picture. Vivian is out of the question. Judy is off somewhere magical. We'll need to find some with, someone with grump, gumption. Gravitas. There's this veteran, Catherine, who would work. Apparently she's been taking in nature recently. Somewhere an obscure canopy, I believe. Wait, one second. Just had another idea. We could also go the demure naive route. Someone like Ingrid. She could also do justice to our new movie. She just bought a new place in Old Central District. You could go meet her there. Ah, so many possibilities. Casting movies, what a rush. All right, I'll leave it in your capable hands. Find us a match. Someone that you think will pop on the screen. Oh, okay. Can't do that. Yeah, I need a zip line to the other one. Some lunatic wakes me up every day. He jumps in the water screaming. He always says, oh, what is it? I'm the big fish, man, or something like that. He's so loud. It's not just the screaming, it's the thrashing in the water. Poor fellow doesn't seem to know how to swim. Should close my bedroom window. Maybe not. I came here for the ocean breeze. He came with the early bird swimmer. <laughs> Got this. Ooh, an antique bust, okay. All of these are locked. Uh-oh, can I not get back up? Oh, there's something in the water. Money! Old coin collection. Okay. Back to Larry. Oh my god.
Oh. Can I not climb up this? No. How the heck did I get up there just then? Okay. So we can't get in here, so we must- Oh, I saw that last minute. Heat treated crab. And I need zip line to do this. <laughs> Missed. Alright. That's okay. We have to go get that ability at some point. Alright. Um... What did I say we we're gonna go do? Albert. Make the ship bigger. What else is out here? Ooh. Not much. Alright. What's that wall? Oh, I was like, what's that walrus out there? That's Susan. <laughs> I know you want chicken, my god. I should look and see if one of maybe the uh, vendors sells chicken. Let me check on this stuff up here. You're fed. No, you're not. Have some corn. You're fluffy and probably hungry. No, you're not hungry. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Bam, 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 bam. Ba, ba, da, da. I love this guy. All right, back to Albert. Blah, blah, blah. Go here. Okay, now to Albert so we can get a bigger ship. And then we can figure out what we need for this marble and aluminum. So we're gonna have to take on the, uh, that dragon again, no problem. Um, what do we need for, like, a full-on upgrade? This one. Iron ingots. Can I go- do we have any iron ore that I can make ingots out of? Oh my god, <laughs> that sheep falling scares me every single time. Hold on, let me- I want to see if we can make some iron ingots. I don't think we have any- Oh, we do! Okay. Just make these. iron ingots and then uh, maybe we can do both upgrades because I want to see what happens when you upgrade the blueprint machine again get some more stuff I think that's good how many do we need I need I'm gonna need to do another round Six. Six. 
Okay, there's our five. Let's do, um... Another round. And then we'll go to get our upgrades. Got it. Okay. Iron ingots. And now, let's go see Albert. Bum, 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 bum. La, da, da, da. Yeah, hopefully a couple upgrades, but... You've got a beautiful orchard full of apples. You do know what lives and reads inside, don't you? What? Bookworms! Ah, oh, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> Hey, dude. Um, I like an upgrade. How much do we have? Oh, we can do both. Chicken coop, lounge, and crusher. Let's get this first. 16,000 jays. Chicken coop, yep. And then this one comes with smithy, cow stall, and cellar. And that's the most we can do. Silica powder, zinc ingot. 16,000. Uh, I need one more spirit flower for rock destroyer. Okay. All right. Thank you, Albert. Let's look at... Marble aluminum ingot. Pulsar ingot, ash plank, zinc, ash, and copper. We could make this a chicken coop. The other thing we got? Oh, this. A lounge. Relax, have a drink, listen to a tune. Really? Okay. Well, what I think we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. Um, and when we come back, what we'll do is we will uh, go and turn in that wood carving to that guy. Probably get a new person on, a, on our ship. Um, I'm just, I know I just looked. Marble. I got to figure out where to get marble. And do some aluminum stuff. Okay. Yep. So we're going to play around with that. So guys, I want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Spirit Fair Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. All right. Bye, everyone.